So, anyways, uh, we will now try to uh, reassemble our um, our little buffer here. Then we'll see. I'm going to start using the eye treatment later for, 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 for a bit just to let my, uh, to let my hair grow back because I uh, used the um, I used the uh, straight razor and uh, I, I get too close with my straight razor sometimes and sometimes it just makes me uh, gives me um, ingrown hair and so that sucks. That's where all these uh, very, very monkey lumps come from. So this thing doesn't work too well underwater as you can see. I somehow for some reason um, not, a, not at the place. Maybe I should do, because there, there are tutorials on, online where you can sharpen these things. You get a cheap ass, uh, you get a cheap ass 50 cent mirror some 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 uh, some kind of grinding paste or something and then just grind away on the mirror so it's just you know and uh, we're gonna try that. There's lots of there's lots of hobby shops here in uh, there's lots of uh, there's lots of uh, DIY shops here in Calgary that I can do that I probably and then I don't have to pay forty forty dollars, twenty five dollars. It's not you know, it's for the environment. How they how how fresh things work is um they'll produce things only so there's a demand for it, there's an order for it, right? And then they'll go okay, so they will be going to okay right away, I'll make another X amount of X amount of uh X amount of uh items. Recording still, right? Yeah. My glasses are off. Right? And, uh, we still have a water bottle. So that's just a bottle. We still have 
Uh, there's some in Cal there's some in California, there's some in uh, all over North America. So anyways, steam goes bye bye. The highlight of my day. All the steam is leaving. Steam goes bye bye. Oh I just dropped something over. <coughs> sleeping my mum's sleeping pad. A sleeping sleeping mask. <laughs> I don't have my glasses on so. Sometimes I like to op uh, leave leave some of the steam in there, uh, just to. Uh, and I close. I don't. I don't open the door. I just leave it in here, and it all just uh, gets really moist. So as I was saying, uh, we gotta hurry though. Um, as I was saying, uh, yeah. Sometimes, these, sometimes these um, these uh, these um, these churches, uh, they're 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 they're. they're, they're Private organizations, they they this is still allowed. They I mean, still they still teach that the the they main canon of the church. They're not they're not like a different church on its own unless you're a Protestant church or and you form your own church. Um, so usually it's just a bunch of people who just meet together and live together uh, within the same uh, same confines, and that's what these most of these these, these communities are. And these communities are self-sufficient. They, uh, they, 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 they have their own unique. Uh, it's just it's like a specific. It's like a it's like a you know how in college you have or, or high school or in college you have a study groups of Bibles with a bunch of Catholic Christian friends and whatnot and you all meet together or. What's up with that? And it's always they always in harmony with the church because it's still part of the church kind of thing. You know what? Oh well, I opened it up already. I was going to use this for that, the last remaining of this. Okay, so always what I usually do is I usually grab a uh, a clipper thing, and this here you snaps onto the bottom. This thing here snaps onto the bottom of a uh, toothpaste, and you just squeeze the toothpaste out to get out as much as using my teeth here, using as much as possible. And then see, I, I, gave my, I saved myself a whole shitload of uh, toothpaste right there. There we go. That's at least a few more, a few more, a few more brushes. <coughs> and then waste that one, not. So, yeah, we talked about religious orders, and uh, talking about Catholic orders, and. Uh, kind of smell in here as well, like new age oils, and that really goes to my nose and cleans up all that shit. That's why I kind of enjoy coming to shower here once a year. Making a show, making a show for you guys. Normally we 
had the mirror. Only, only, only I'm gonna try again and have the um, radio on. <laughs> oh my god, that's gross. Like I said, it's dust in the air, it's dust outside. Uh, Calgary, it could be worse though. I mean, I could be living in Edmonton still. Living underneath Refinery Road back to Kirkness, and holy shit, that was. It's a nice neighborhood. I mean, I, I, I live there. I mean. But. You know, I lived there. In the 80s, and people don't realize that in the 80s, uh, these, 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 these oil companies and stuff had to go environmental, and as much as possible, they, they kind of um, put filters on the, their, their, their chimneys, and, and the chimneys start spewing out um, filtered version of the toxic goo, so it's not too bad. But the toxic goo, toxic goo always come out, you know? And that's why you engage in all this environmental reduce, 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 uh, reuse, and Reduce, reuse, and recycle the three R's, the three R's of um, living this 21st century high-tech world, or 21st, 20th century in my case, last, 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 last century ago, and uh, try to be as environmental possible, as environmental as possible. We're using uh, those coils, those coil-like bulbs there. They'll last a while, they'll last a few years, or at least at least 10 years or so, and uh, my other light bulbs are all burnt out, all, all dying, and all burnt out and ready to be changed. And uh, we're gonna try and like we try like I said we're gonna show you I'm gonna show, I'm gonna I'm gonna go and shop for some uh, really cheap ass uh, uh, healthy stuff too. But we gotta hurry because uh, I gotta catch a bus at uh, around uh, ten uh, nine fifty seven. So why not to say ten o'clock right? For just the same time. Well, that's episode two of the shower show. Uh, there's much more episodes out there, and I know you guys are. I'll see you with me by razor burns and ooh. I think I'm getting it from some kind of a weird. It doesn't show in the mirror, but it, but it shows that I got all this. Uh, oh, uh, because the shower is hot, and also because I'm using different soap. And when you use different soap, the uh, body kind of catches. The body kind of uh, has to catch up to the, the, its new uh, pH level to figure out what the hell is going on. I look like it's pretty much look like look a dead look like, look like a dead zombie because I got up early in the morning. So, oh shit, looking, looking like my dad. Oh, he's not looking pretty good either. Hmm. Well, at least I, at least I, I got a good, I got a good excuse for this. Uh, you know, I'm studying all night, helping classmates and stuff. So, I what you call this new show? This channel, Buddha takes a shower. Ah, Buddha takes a shower. The funny picture of myself on Facebook, and uh, where it has me uh, as a uh, Buddha, the second Buddha, that's uh, laughing with the laughing one. I'm going. You know, uh, bald head, because ah. <laughs> I look just like him. So I am pretty much Buddha reincarnated. This is Buddha taking a shower. Ah, okay. I'm gonna change my YouTube name and then call myself Buddha taking a shower. Ah.